Hey folks, Pilot Master 72 here. In the first segment of a tutorial, I will be bringing to you guys that explains how to use the ATC system in X Plane 10. So I'm going to come into my cockpit here, and there's a couple things I'm going to do to get ready for my flight. First, I am going to set my autopilot. So I'm going to load my flight plan that I've downloaded from online into my flight computer. I'm going to direct that in and up in my autopilot I'm going to set it to GPS localizer I'll hold an altitude of around I'll just do 20,000 feet there we are my vertical speed I'll do 1000 and I'll probably be flying around I'll do 350 knots there we are so, my autopilot is now up and ready to go, but this is where we get into the ATC segment of our pre-flight. The first thing we're going to do is check our local map. So you come up into location, local map. Now you'll see our airports. Yours probably will not be clicked. You're going to click on the name of your airport, and you'll see up in the right corner comes a box. Now this has all of the uh, radio frequencies that you're going to need. For the pre-flight segment, we're just going to use the ATIS, the clearance. That's going to get us ready to taxi. I'm going to click out of this. Back in our cockpit, I'm going to get the ATIS information. So I look down at my radio, change my frequency to 132. Oh, I'm sorry, COM1. So I'll bring it down to 132.40. There we are. So I'll click into it and get the ATIS. Medical information in view. 2200 view of weather. Sky condition 25,000. Scattered 42,000. Scattered visibility 16. Temperature 112.1. Wind 340 at 5. Altimeter two nine nine two. Arriving and departing runway zero one right, zero one left. Advise on initial contact you have in view. All right, so there we are. We've got the altimeter setting, which uh, is set correctly. We've got wind directions, we've got clouds, and we've got runway active. That's the ATIS information. So the next part is we have to file our flight plan. So if you hit enter, you'll get this box that comes up. Go up to File Flight Plan, click. So you're on this new page. This is where we go back to what we had in our FMC. Now I've written down all that information and I recommend you do. So I know where I'm taking off from. I would like to fly at a round, if I can, bring that down, oh, 20,000 feet. There we are. I'm going to be arriving LA. K L A. There we are. And now my route is filled with a bunch of different fixes and VORs, and then L A. So now I'm gonna get that and I'm gonna file it. There we are. Now that is in the ATC system, and I, I'll get called back to that. Right now, I'm gonna get clearance to fly that route. So it's another frequency for McCarran Airport. It is one one eight. Point zero zero. Click that in. Now, up in my box, I can request clearance. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Seven eight seven. Clear IFR to Kilo Lima Alpha X ray at file. Maintain flight level two zero zero. Cross four seven zero two. Anything in red is speaking to me, and I have to return and read it back. Anything in yellow is me talking to them. So I have to go ahead and squawk 4702. There we are. And now I have clearance to fly that. Thank you for watching the first episode. Next episode will be up soon. Thanks for watching.